plugged into a church community can be challenging at times, but hey, I got some good news for you. One, our church is pretty dang friendly, all right? And two, we have a myriad of ways for you to connect for all generations. So whether you're signing your kids up for one of our July summer fun days, like the big drop that's gonna be later in the month, or your senior adult hanging out with your fellow senior adult for our fellowship. We got an ice cream and him sing fellowship coming up here really soon. Well, we have got you covered. And of course, we have our 9.30 a.m. Sunday morning grow groups for all generations and all walks of life as we encourage each other in our pursuit of Christ. So if you need some help trying to figure out how to plug in and find a group, come and talk to me as a Connections Pastor. I would love to help you find your place in our family. Hey church family, we are just two days away from student camp and as I mentioned last week, we have a lot of guests coming with us this year and we have some students that maybe can't afford to go to camp or need a little bit of help. That's where you come in church family. We are needing scholarships. The cost for camp is $340. If you could give part of that, some of that, uh, all of that, Either way, we'd love to talk with you. Come find me at the back table in the foyer. I'll also be there giving out prayer cards of every student going and some ways that you can pray for. So come see me back at the table. Be sure to get one of those. And if you can help out, let me know. Thanks so much. Alrighty, Wednesday night Bible study is back this week with Pastor Wes's series on church history. And of course, there will also be webs for your kids right there. Check them in in the MPB lobby. And yes, this we, we did record a new episode of our Thursday's Roundtable podcast with Pastor Wes, Matt, and myself. We share our favorite mission trip stories and fails. It is a great episode, so be sure to check it out and share it with a friend. Now, don't forget, if you have any items you want to donate for the homeless ministry, for the pregnancy center, for the food pantry, or for Operation Christmas Child, then take those items over there to the donation station. It's right there on the east side of the foyer. We've got a bucket for each of those things to so drop off your items right there in one place. Now, I want to let you know, Operation Christmas Child, the item of the month is clothing. So be sure to look into that as well. And the food pantry is really running low on supplies. So anything you can donate will make a huge difference in that ministry.